The Experience Pros Radio Show, home of the original Fan Bragging Fridays. Take just 20 seconds to become a revolutionary by sharing a Fan Bragging story of great customer service on Facebook.com slash Experience Pros. Now, back to Angel and Eric, the Experience Pros. It's business tips and insights here on the Experience Pros Radio Show. Hey, does uh, telling your story so it gets heard, understood, and remembered sometimes feel like mission impossible? And Jerry Brown of Jerry Brown PR can help. Jerry's here on the Experience Pros Radio Show every week at this time with a tip to help you tell your story. Jerry, welcome back. Thank you. Good what's to our, be here. What's our storytelling tip this week? Well, our storytelling tip this week is don't let the facts get in the way of your story. Whoa, whoa, what? whoa, whoa. Oh, hey, what? Are you suggesting we play a little loose with the truth there, Jerry? And no, no, that thing? no, no, absolutely not. I'm, being honest and straightforward with your audience is extremely important, but it really is about, it's about what you include in your story, but equally important, and people don't realize this, it's about what you leave out of your story. You know, your story is, a story is really a narrative, and that's how we think, and it's how we communicate with one another. We tell stories all day long, uh, just very naturally. But it's it, when you're telling your story about your business, you, you usually have a message. You have something that you want the people you're trying to reach to know about your business and maybe something you want them either to believe or to do. But I want them to understand everything. Well, if you want them to ever understand everything, they're going to end up understanding nothing and probably remembering nothing of what you say. So... You have to really boil it down and give us enough facts to be credible and to know what we need to know, but leave out all that other junk. It's really, literally, you've heard the expression, can't see the forest for the trees. Yes. If you put too many facts in your story, it literally is a case of that, that the, the your audience won't see your forest. They'll just see a bunch of trees, and they won't know what to do with them. All right, so if we are not going to let our facts get in the way of the story... Jerry, we're going to need help because we know all we have in our head is facts. And we don't really think of our business as a as a story. We always think of it in, in, in terms of facts, don't you think? You know, we all know how to tell stories. Uh, now, one of the things we do, the places where stories fail is we either try to include too many facts or too many things, or we make them too self-serving because we're trying to promote ourselves. Right. You know, the things that you want to talk about in terms of yourself and being self-service and self-serving and how wonderful you are, that's the favorite part of your story right. to you. Right. Mm -hmm. For the rest of us, you know, not so much. We want to know what you can do for us. And so um, it really is about boiling it down to where we remember it. I mean, you know, if, if you ask somebody or somebody asks you what you did on your vacation, I hope you don't give them a minute by minute breakdown of everything that happened well, you hotel, give them kind of the highlights our hotel cost this much and we were on delay on the right. ground for yeah. 17 minutes and, yeah. and we've all been through that yes. and it's really boring and you know what nobody's going to remember any of that absolutely but well, if you tell us that you saw whales jumping out of the water or you got to swim with the dolphins we're going to remember that yeah, I right. love it. I right, love it. And so this is why we bring Jerry Brown in every week, because you do have a story to tell. It's not a sales pitch. Right. It is a story. But there are also things. Jerry can also help you with uh, media postings, articles, press releases, PowerPoint presentations, blog posts, and more. And, Jerry, you can also help us edit what we've already written, right? Absolutely. All right. So the late journalist, screenwriter, and Denver native Gene Fowler once said, writing is easy. All you have to do is st sit staring at a blank sheet of paper until drops of blood form on your forehead. Keep your forehead dry and hire Jerry Brown of Jerry Brown PR. JerryBrownPR.com or by phone 303-594-8016. That's 303-594-8016. Jerry Brown, you make this mission possible. Thank you so much for being here. Glad to be here. Absolutely. So, I feel better. Oh, you do? Right. Were you feeling badly? Well, I, no, I, you know me. I, I'm a little uh, give you the detail, give you the detail, give you the detail. You ask me what time it is, I'll build you a big Ben. You build me a clock. Yep. You're listening to Angel and Eric on the most positive business talk show in America. The experienced pros are here to help you get your business right. To learn more, visit experiencepros.com.